Welcome to Sad Boys, a podcast about feelings and other things also. I'm Jarvis. I'm Jordan. Howdy. Howdy. I do that now. Oh, yeah. That's his new okay. thing, his new cool? identity. Did cool. You, do you like it? Or? Yeah. Yeah. And for those at home, the hat is CGI. We actually paid the Marvel people. Mm-hmm. You can remember, It's hard to tell because I'm sure it looks very good. <laughs> and it does. It's not just like a JPEG with the outline. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's real good. We are joined by a very special guest today. We are joined by the one and only... <laughs> Sergeant Curtis Connor. Yeah, at ease. At ease. <laughs> okay, okay, thank at you. Ease voice. Howdy, partner. <laughs> Howdy. Thanks for having me, guys. Uh, thanks for coming through. This is your first, uh, second time on the podcast. First time at the new, the new spot. Yeah, yeah. So now well, there's like third a time, I guess. Time, oh fuck. Including. Yeah. The last time we did it on, over the internet, in the in yeah, the, in the, the lost era. Yeah, the E zone. Yeah, <laughs> the E zone. The that forgotten was, times. That's before yeah. we were funny. <laughs> I, Any of us, yeah. I looked at one of those um so we have both been out uh for a couple of weeks though you might not have noticed it on your feeds but i got a surgery two weeks ago i was uh, doing it, Jordan was doing it. <laughs> uh, they realized halfway through he was not qualified i went underground for two weeks an underground jail <laughs> for two weeks uh they just let him out they just let me out of my bed <laughs> and so while we were out we ended up releasing on our patreon uh an old uh episode that was never released that we did with zach from the try guys whoa and it was on it was on Twitch when we were doing the podcast live for like a brief period in like I remember that twenty twenty one, and uh, but it never came out because the video sat unlisted on our YouTube channel, and then at some point in twenty twenty one I got depressed and then never hit upload, and then mm. time just passed and it never <laughs> came out. And uh, we literally so, had like what I thought was maybe a Mandela effect. We were in a meeting, we were like on the phone, and we went like, "What are we going to put out?" It's not like a fucking episode no, in literally. studio. <laughs> it's such a dated episode too because Zach talks about Quibi on that. <laughs> oh, wow. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like oh he had a God. meeting with the Quibi executives. Oh, wow. Pre, uh, they, you know, evaporating. That's but so interesting. What happened? But in that episode, <laughs> in that episode, we look so weird <laughs> it's like, it was like i don't know if we, either of us were taking care of ourselves but then also we have like a I different <laughs> yeah we have a different like palette swap of like hairstyle oh yeah that's true yeah right. it's just odd i don't know yeah even the first episode that i that we did that i did on, on your podcast even i like i don't I mean, like I think it's because I don't have any. I don't have a mustache. And I just right, look fucking so right, weird. Yeah, it's a different Curtis uh, era. Yeah, yeah. It just looks. It, it makes me like sad to look. At. It's like, <laughs> like who is that guy? Dude, hey, Era's tour starring Curtis. Connor. <laughs> yeah. Was there a catalyst for you changing your look? Uh, was it the podcast? You wanted to look like Idubs, I think. Yeah, yeah. Definitely <laughs> wanted to do and a that. Of the wall. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, Idubs, fucking he. He did. It, that. it was. It was. It was I started it. Yeah, you start. No, no, yeah. no, for sure. You I, definitely, I was the first. You okay. Every yeah, time, let go of me, man. Every time they say, "What is this genre of man called?" Oh, I'm yeah. like, you, you know, you started it. Yeah, I was patient zero. You were patient zero. <laughs> That's the pandemic we're not talking yeah. about. Yeah. <laughs> White dudes with mullets and mustache. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know. I think I. Well, I started with the mullet because I saw I was uh, the season of Drag Race that was on. There was a drag queen named Crystal Method. Yeah. And they had like a really cool mullet. And I was like, I could do that. I think that'd be really I cool. I saw that season actually. Yeah, yeah it was a good Crystal season. Crystal Method was dope. Yeah, yeah shout out Crystal name. Method. Um, and then I think I was just like, I think Jenna like I really was like, cause I was like the must, it's like, there's like a weird time of like when it's like yeah. coming in. Um, so it's I was happening like, here right now. Yeah. This is the, I'm, yeah, you're, you like, you, you know, dare I say you look like evil Jordan. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm just the regular version. <laughs> yeah. Hey, um, I like Britain. Oh, shit. Whoa, I this think guy. it's good. Wait, how do you feel about French people? <laughs> My best friend. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Things are not okay. Cut Get the this camera. guy out of here. Uh, uh, I literally just didn't shave while I was back in the UK. And then I'm like, let's see what happens. Because I also can't do shit. Here. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's on the, only on the, there. On the chops. In fact, I can grow this portion oh, of yeah. upper cheek and not the Dude, lower, which should, is the only part you need. <laughs> we should fuse because, like, I, I, like, only get, like, these little hairs up here that I feel like from afar give an optical illusion that something's going on. But, right. like, when I look, I'm like, I could 
tweeze each one of these out individually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 I can't, I can, it comes in there a lot. And then like, mm. I, they, and on the sides, but they never, I don't think they're ever going to connect ever. It sucks. <laughs> Damn. Hey, well, you could start, what's this st style of guy called? Yeah. <laughs> right. <looks> fucked up. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Bad. Weird. Yeah. It looks Ugly. like he's leaning into his natural hair growth <laughs> and we don't like and it. And we would not like <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, it's not okay. I think it's, it is a weird thing when you make any kind of like stylistic change, especially when your face is on camera a lot. Yeah. Where like mm -hmm. the people will ask for context. Like, what happened? <laughs> yeah. Was this you did this? Or someone else did this to yeah. you? <laughs> Who did this to you? <laughs> Promise me you'll stop. <laughs> You've now had that look for uh, quite some time. Yeah. Are you, are you still getting people going like, where? What happened? Yeah, yeah, all the time. Weird. I, I guess because they watch your old videos. Maybe they like. True. I yeah. just binge your whole thing, and they watch like ye like five, six years <laughs> yeah. of like content and growth. <laughs> right. And, and they then, watch them out of order. It's like the heck yeah. is going back. Yeah, what's happening? It was a weird Benjamin Button situation. <laughs> There was one I did a at JFL. I did like this uh, my buddy's like podcast. I did it live, and they did like a Q and A thing at the end. And the one one of the girls' question was like, <laughs> I'm trying to remember her wording, but she was like, "So is your haircut like a joke?" <laughs> <laughs> she's like is it part of the the whole the bit and i was like no asshole what's it's my bit? head what's the joke the j i like the, the way bit. i look <laughs> yeah i feel was, comfortable with my old skin it That's was the so bit. mean i had to let and to like not be like it took everything in my body not to be like Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> How dare you say that? No, that's um <laughs> What do you think my answer is? <laughs> yeah. I uh I'm like I don't want this person to feel bad, but I was um walking at uh I was walking playing Pokemon Go, had my uh had my AirPods in and then someone like ran up to me and poked me on the shoulder mm -hmm. and Whoa. I went Ah, <laughs> because that's terrifying <laughs> because I didn't see them. They like approached from my blind right. spot. And you were in Pokemon world. You and I was, was in like Pokemon world. Or something. I'm a Kanto, I'm also, bro. Tap, tapping like, your shoulder. I, I'm an easy sweater. So like if I'm out and about and I'm playing Pokemon Go, I'm walking <laughs> at a brisk pace. Mm. I'm sweating. You know, I'm in my own little zone. Right. And they were so nice and they just wanted to say hi and they just wanted a picture. But like the immediate like feeling of like someone like pokes you and you're like ah and then they're like can i have a picture yeah. and you're like yeah yes <laughs> yeah for sure sorry let me so, shake off whatever is yeah. going on right now <laughs> i swallow this puke that's in my mouth right now. <laughs> <laughs> sorry i <Yeah>. think no <laughs> no but it's like they meant they meant so well you know yeah. what i mean like it's yeah like, of course it's yeah. totally not a um they, like they didn't they're not a bad person they didn't do anything bad uh it's just like i wasn't ready like i'm not always ready to be a person right yeah yeah, yeah you're in pokemon go mode is yeah. this pokemon go part go of mode. the bit huh <laughs> is pokemon go a joke <laughs> yeah, yeah. Really a joke no i i actually did get somebody say that remember uh what? someone tweeted um are you being paid to promote this? Because otherwise, you're too old for this shit. Oh, no. And I was like, oh, go all the way to hell. Oh, wait. Yeah, I think you told me about <laughs> yeah, that. I yeah, I think I just responded like, what did I even say? Like, I just said that it was wild to be hating for no reason or something yeah. like that. And they deleted it. You got no, uh, they got no whimsy. Yeah. Yes, that was the conversation we had. Yeah, they that's had, what they, we said. Dude, let, let a guy have some whimsy. That's yeah, they got I'm no saying. joy in their heart. No joy. Yeah. I got that joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Down in my heart. Right. Down in my heart. Preach. Come on, man. What is he singing? What is it? Huh? What is he doing? Is it a song? I'm drunk, man. <laughs> What's the game? I think that might up. be an evil Jordan song. <laughs> yeah. Come on. From his man. timeline. <laughs> what are you talking? <clears throat> what are you talking about? <laughs> oh, whoa. He British. just. Oh, did you hear that? He was <sighs> not British for a what second. What are you talking about? Anyway, do you guys want to friggin' topple the government or some shit? <laughs> <laughs> No. Yeah. No, no me neither. Oh, yeah. No, sorry. Oh, wait. Hold on. No, you seem like you might be into it. I was saying something else. <laughs> okay. His goatee's coming. You can't really. <laughs> <laughs> no is kind of a sh one word sentence. <laughs> it, I f yeah, I was like doing the Canadian pronunciation of no. Or it's, uh, it's, it's uh, yeah, no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Yeah. No. 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 Def no yeah. The Canadian pronunciation is, I would not like not to. Not like to. Absolutely. No. Yeah. I have a Canadian themed gift. Whoa! Before we get into that, we have a word from today's sponsor, Babbel. Do you happen to speak any languages other than English? No. 
that was Spanish. Oh. Babbel is an app designed to help you start learning a language in as early as three weeks. Babbel is designed by real people for real conversations. All of Babbel's tips and tools for learning a new language are approachable, accessible, rooted in real life situations, and they're spoken by real people and not robots. So instead of wasting time and money on a private tutor or a mobile app that's little more than a game, check out Babbel's conversation-based teaching. Babbel's quick 10-minute lessons are designed by over 150 language experts. We have a special limited time deal just for our listeners that you can use right now. It is 55% off of your subscription by heading on over to babbel.com slash sad. That's 55% off at babbel.com slash sad. Rules and restrictions may apply. Thanks to Babbel for sponsoring this video. Now back to boys. Now back to boys. Uh, yeah. I have a Canadian themed gift. Whoa. Whoa. Curtis. Gift guy. <laughs> Me. Take He's our Canadian yeah. gift. Please. He's all yours. So I, I bought this for you as a gift during my, um, my, my time back in the UK. However, Curtis being here, it's actually kind of relevant to it. Whoa. Okay. Oh, I think I know what it might be. It's a okay. ugly little guy. <laughs> oh, <laughs> asshole. I'm going to write, I'm going to write down what I think it is. It was like the newlyweds game. <laughs> yeah. This is like a magic trick. Yeah. Curtis yeah. Look in your back pocket. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Curtis, do you have any guess? Uh, so it's for Jarvis, but it, it relates to me somehow. It relates to your fine nation. Okay. Of uh, French and you America. Got it. Where'd you get it? I got it in the Gantwick Airport. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you didn't what, like that. <laughs> no. Do you sorry. have a history? Like how, you just didn't like the sound of that word. <laughs> oh. Gatwick. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't sound real. It does sound made up. Um. Yeah, that's like the smaller one, right? It's he throws the, the. It's a smaller one. It's in a place that makes no sense. Right. A lot of poker stops. Let me tell you. Uh, okay. <laughs> Um, okay, maybe it's like um, like maple syrup or Stupid something. Answer. Okay. Stupid answer. Stupid right. answer. I like I that guess. I like that guess. Idiot. <laughs> okay, how am I supposed to know? I don't know. A uh, Gatwick. That's my guess. Don't say it out loud. Uh, okay, yeah, that probably makes you guess. You can't say that right. word. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, I can't read it. <laughs> it's not your word. <laughs> what? <Yo! laughs> Let's go. Let's go, dude. It is a royal palace guard phone box themed mini kit kat collection this Whoa. is so sick Ten, which then later doubles as a piggy bank i guess oh an I, unbreakable you, piggy bank. <laughs> you stuff your kit kat back in there it's like a like a cheese shredder <laughs> yeah <laughs> only you, the wafer gets in you just rub yeah. the kit kat in you eat all the kit kat you, you poop poop them back in yeah. through the slot <laughs> or the, put the wrappers in there as is the british way yeah. uh, damn but yes um dude that's oh by the way of course you I got know, it. but the He's tip was because we connected over the Canadian Kit Kats. Now they're superior. They are they're superior. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In, in, to my recollection, they tasted like the Kit Kats I grew up with. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, okay, is this a deviation on the part of America or is this just like the power of European influence? <laughs> 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 Do the European sanctions on America mean right. you can't get good ones? Does, is Brexit going to ruin Kit Kats? It probably England? is somewhere along the line, literally tariff related. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah. Of dude, I thought I was going crazy when I had a Kit Kat in America for the first time. They I was suck. Like, yeah, really I was like, what the f am I like? I don't know, like, is my taste, do I have COVID or something? Is my, like, <laughs> my like, taste buds going like, away? why can't I smell this Yankee candle? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Or this Kit Kat bar? <laughs> Maybe I should get vaccinated. <laughs> yeah. Nah, never. No, never. Dude, nah, the jab. <laughs> yeah. Dude, <laughs> sorry. Start flashback to when I recently, right before the surgery, got my flu shot and my, like, oh, yeah. the uh, new COVID booster. I thought my, you were going to die. <laughs> <laughs> it was, I got them both in the same arm, too. On the same day? On the same day. Oh, like, my a few God. Hours I asked Same beforehand. You can <laughs> I asked beforehand. Yeah. I was like, is this cool to do? And they're like, yeah. And I was like, okay. I'm and on. then I was like, it wasn't cool. Oh, no. <laughs> is this cool to do? I'm it's po it's a possible. I don't <laughs> you know if you can. should do it. Yeah. It's uh, weird the hit rate that medical professionals will have on like a the confidence in a question <laughs> and how wrong it will be. I was like, hey, is this right? And they're like, who's to say? I don't know. I don't know. What's up? It's not my Shut body. Yeah, I don't um, care. Doctor. I, I was telling my... Um, 
my ear, nose, and throat doctor who did the surgery for my nose. Well, I got a septoplasty for those who aren't in the know to fix my breathing through my nose, which I've never done. Well, I never fully been able to do. Like I can't get enough oxygen to like sustain. I get like lightheaded if I breathe through my nose. And I can't, Damn. I mean like, I went to my Look post stop. Yeah. What the hell? I went to my- <laughs> The doctors um, are there. <laughs> <laughs> I got I got a septoplasty <laughs> with a turbinate reduction, which sounds Whoa. like a fancy dish. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Somebody yeah. Didn't even get it. <laughs> <laughs> we have a uh, uh, we have a septoplasty with a turbinate reduction, <laughs> and it's like my nose with like a purple sauce yeah. next to it. Some we have caviar you, on top. Of it. We have Kit Kats that are good. <laughs> yeah, and um, I was telling them that. I was getting dizzy when I would turn my head sometimes. And you know, like your uh, inner ear is like where like balance is mm -hmm. like- Yeah, uh, like fluids in there. And yeah, stuff, right? and, and I've had like a, a litany of ear troubles in childhood that don't really bother me that much now, but whenever I get a cold, I like get fl crazy fluid buildup behind my ear. So I assumed it was something Damn. related to that. But um, I told them that I was getting dizzy and then their response to me was that I had... Um, bad head. Like like just going back to like <laughs> doctors having um, bad... We talked about uh, doctors having bad bedside manner, but this was just a situation where... Yeah. I was like, oh yeah, so I'm getting kind of dizzy. And then she's like, yeah, for the ben benign positional vertigo, you're gonna want to Google E the E plea maneuver. And I was like, I'm sorry? Yeah, uh, English plea? <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> the nose is bleeding. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like just level with me. Like, just give me a little bit of a, I'm, you know, I like to learn. Right. You could give me, yeah. you could go, hey, so you being dizzy like that, that's a form of vertigo. That's mm -hmm. not That's not that big a deal. Well, they don't so like that's to That's why teach. it's benign. <laughs> and it's based on your position. So it's positional. So it's benign positional. <laughs> Positional vertigo, and I was, and then I would be like, "Oh, okay, that makes okay, sense." Got but it. then I had to go like do research afterward <laughs> to like translate what the doctor had just said to me. Yeah, and then there's apparently some sort of exercise that you can do called the Eepley maneuver that like helps you with that. The EP? when you're EP, you do the Eepley maneuver. Yeah, <laughs> they lied to you. That's not real. Man. The, I yeah. do the EP maneuver every night. <laughs> yeah, dude, dude, that's why you can breathe so good. <laughs> yeah, you haven't slept, dude. I haven't slept. <laughs> you're doing pretty well. <laughs> I am so freaking EP. Getting to sleep study and being like, so what do I fucking do? What do I, I do? Sit yeah. down. I like, oh, is this the part where we, open? I don't we all lie down and we just close our eyes for a while. <laughs> and then when your partner wakes up, you pretend you slept because you don't want to think <laughs> you're Oh, life. man. I, oh, Damn. Um, do you guys yeah, ever watch? Like, I feel like it is me when it's. When doctors do that, it's like, I take it as an insult. <laughs> yeah. It's like, how you, you, fuck you. Like, yeah. <laughs> tell me what Just, it is. Oh, it takes two more additional seconds. Yeah. Because when then, I, I think they get a thing out of, out of some people being like, what is that? And they go, oh, oh you don't know what, what yeah. a bilateral. Mr. School, can you help me? <laughs> yeah. Or like, I don't know. yeah, it's like when someone says they have a problem with their phone, I don't like go into a technical <laughs> description of like right. why the issue is happening. Yeah. I was like, oh, the, the internet's not working. Oh, well, there might be an issue with the certificates or maybe like it's HTTP <laughs> versus HTTPS. <laughs> Um, no, it's like, yeah. and then I go, my brain, it's growing. <laughs> I, I'm getting stronger. <laughs> I'm nutting. <laughs> um, uh, what the, what the hell, how the hell are you? Yeah, you man. Bastard. All right. Okay. <laughs> Jesus. Man. Sorry. Whoa. It's about something else. Ask how I am and then insult me. I'm the evil one. Dude, but anyway, um, how are you? You I'm piece good. of shit. Yeah, <laughs> I'm good, guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. I'm happy to be here. I'm having... A great time until like 10 seconds ago. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, that tracks, me, that tracks. Is it mainly, I know you're doing some shows and stuff, but it, it's mainly a, le is it a leisure trip mostly? Um, it's like a, you know, half, half leisure, half, um, like a, it's like a little press tour, I guess, a little press junkie, oh, yeah, if you will. Cause this guy's, I mean, I don't know what, when we can, what we can talk about. Um, I have a comedy special coming out on November 10th. It's called Keep Busy. It's on November 10th. Ooh, keep busy. That's a good title. Thank you. Dude, I'm a judger of stand-up oh, yeah. titles. Been been it for 20 years. Yeah. There's some good ones and there's some real stinkers. You consider doing one where your arms are crossed and it's called triggered question mark? Okay, <laughs> hold on. Can we talk about this for a second? Because cancel culture is not real. Do you remember Shane Gillis? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How he got canceled. He got yeah. taken off of SNL. And now, and like like and now he's the top yeah. <laughs> like he's stand -up special on Netflix. Yeah. And what is it called? It has a name that's like. Oh, it's called like some dog. 
It's a couple dogs. Yeah, something like that. Um, yeah. <laughs> dog. I mean, I haven't listened to it. I don't know what type of stuff he talks about, but it's really funny. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Yeah, that's super funny. I mean, Shane's like a funny enough guy. It's just not SNL funny. Yeah, no, but also, yeah. 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 The casting was never real. Like, no, but that's yeah. the thing. It's like canceling is not real. I think that that's like the main thing is like we talk so much about cancel culture and it's like, these people are still succeeding yeah. I, and it's and i think that that's okay like if you if you learn if you grow i think that was like a decade ago or something it was like something yeah super it was long a ago. long time ago um do you, do you uh you talk about this or the special yes the council culture has gone too far yeah um I, oh beautiful it, I, okay it's that's pretty fun. much the whole special is me uh, sort of lampooning a, a, cancel, a gen z and <laughs> right <laughs> taking a couple of swings yeah, at them. yeah they yeah. just they're just not hardened like you used to be back in your yeah i can't say anything anymore man. yeah <laughs> you, you stumble lightly and bump your knee against the mic stand and you're openly weeping and pretending <laughs> you're not tough like it you do the peter griffin <laughs> <laughs> was it uh what's it like honing an, it's an hour it's an hour, yeah. What's the, well, the one that, The one that I'm releasing on the 10th, because I'm I'm releasing it on my website independently. Um, website, so, name it. CurtisConnor.com. Let's go. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah, brother. Fuck yeah. I knew it. Uh, <laughs> so that one, it's like the, because we might put it on like a streaming service like down the road later maybe but um but the one that we're releasing is like the director's cut i guess so the full yeah. thing so it's like an hour 10 i think which, Ooh. Is, which is pretty crazy but so you've messed who's up who's this guy think yeah. he is doing so an hour 10 of his I, own i went long in his own <laughs> special <laughs> sorry <laughs> Are you like doing that thing what <laughs> Chappelle and people do? Or like, I'm just going to keep going. Or like, Cat Williams is I'm four getting and the light, but I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> but it's your show and it's I'm 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like you didn't even go over that much. <laughs> <laughs> and no one's telling me to get up. <laughs> you started uh, really early. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to keep going. Okay. okay. Yeah, everybody's like, all right, fine. Yeah, yeah, so we, it's encore. <laughs> we don't have to pay more. We, like, yeah, we're good here. for us. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to get going. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but that's coming out. I'm really excited. So Would I hope you, everyone watches it. And, you do it in Toronto? Yeah, I filmed it in Toronto the Dan, at the Danforth Music Hall. Let's go. No music, though. No. Yeah, so. Hold Dude. Yeah. out. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. um, are, is, that, is that a venue that, because you, you grew up not in Toronto proper, but mm -hmm. like, yeah. you know, you I'm sure you went to a show, a show or two in Toronto growing up. Yeah, yeah. Did you see any like cool shows at the Danforth, at the Danforth Theater? Danforth? And then you're like, now it's me. I'm the right. show. Oh, I'm in the six. Yeah. I saw, I saw Claro there. That was pretty, Whoa. pretty lit. Uh, I saw, um, I've seen, who else did I see? I've seen a, a couple bands there it's like it's like a, a really good music yeah, venue, yeah. but i saw um terrible comedy bad, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, super yeah bad. Bad. i couldn't hear any <laughs> nobody was laughing that was yeah. an acoustics issue i guess i couldn't hear a single laugh yeah, yeah, i kept yeah. playing so, drums over my <laughs> jokes yeah it looked it like weird. no one was there <laughs> um but no it was uh it's it was, they just put like a bunch of chairs and stuff we had like fucking seven cameras and shit it was gnarly That's it awesome. was crazy i was so nervous it sucked <laughs> it was like the most nerve like nervous i've ever been you did anything. a couple probably right we did two yeah, yeah and the yeah, first yeah. one i was like I don't even remember it. I was like, yeah. I was so fucking scared. Yeah. That's how I feel. Um, <laughs> Watching the footage back and you're just staring out. Hour <laughs> <laughs> 10. But I guess I'll yeah. keep going. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Is this Not crushing? <laughs> oh. Yeah, you look back. Jenna's like, you're killed. Me. You're like, I, I keep going. Oh, I, you, going. I should do another 10. Jenna's got airpods in. <laughs> no, this is, uh, no, this is just, um, I'm on the phone. Yeah. <laughs> Pushing the Shangula special. Yeah. Oh, this yeah what's fun. your real stand up guy? an actual funny person. Wait, is it, do you find any like aversion with watching other specials? It, like, at least while you were cooking with that one? <laughs> is it. Um, like watching friends YouTube videos sometimes is like, uh, am I in the mood for this? Is it going to make me think about what? Yeah, you watch right. Dimitri Martin, you're like, what if I became a one-liner comic? Yeah, what if I was that guy instead? <laughs> right yeah. now, yeah. <laughs> yeah, sometimes, yeah. I think for the most part, when I do watch a special, it's I don't watch a ton of them, but like it's usually the ones I'll watch is people like comedians that I already like. Yeah, and then when I watch them, it's like it's sort of like an inspiring, I guess. It's like because they're like just super funny and they yeah. and. It, sort of like lets you think of how 
like different ways for you to write jokes and behave on a on a right. stage. Cool. It's cool to, to see, see other somebody with it. like the confidence too of like really having done it for like yeah. so many decades. Or yeah, whatever. yeah. And sometimes like, you'll hear like a story on a podcast later or something where it's like, yeah, I don't remember any of it. Like they had an equal level of nervousness, right? And fugue state. Yeah, and yeah. And yeah that's like, comforting. Yeah, it was so scary because it was. It's if it's like on any other show, it's fine. But like the fact that it was like. I had I had like this two shots at it, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I walked out, and I didn't get to like obviously see the crowd before I started filming. So it's right. like I walk out, and the crowd is there, and like the biggest fucking like camera on like the right the arm the fucking cannon like it looked like a satellite arm <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> so big <laughs> fucking moving everywhere oh so yeah scary. like getting the like camera, yeah the, like crouch yeah, it's just it. so loud yeah <laughs> <laughs> there's a drummer on it <laughs> <laughs> yeah that sounds terrible yeah um, claro is <laughs> playing <laughs> is it a big venue uh yeah it was like um usually like we had to do a lot of like uh kills i guess for like the camera um but it was i think there was like a little under a thousand for each show so that's exciting pretty pretty badass that's pretty yeah. badass yeah. Yeah. more listens than that but whatever. okay yeah, yeah i've, no, I've big, dude. seen yeah i mean like i know yeah, i've got like more friends i like hundreds of those. Pokemon go but <laughs> yeah i, I know like i could yeah. yeah well if i if i was if i was allowed to fucking say what i really want to say <laughs> yeah, more true. people go would ahead shout out. Fire yeah. away, please. <laughs> can't say anything anymore. all right here i go <clears throat> <laughs> I guess I'll keep going. <laughs> <laughs> um, Dude, get it, being so nervous and fucking it up, but so confident. About, <laughs> like getting back in the bay and being like, D I crushed it. They love yeah, it. This edit is going to come out so good. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean the edit's two and a half minutes? <laughs> <laughs> it's you, it's intro, and then th you leaving. <laughs> yeah. Curtis Connor, dead air. <laughs> yeah. And then I'm gone. Ooh, dead air, good title. That's, air. Your, yeah, that's, your, that's a good title. Um, yeah. My, no, I just called um, Cancel This. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Okay, so there's uh, a lot that I, we have <laughs> to get to today. A lot of it is randomly AI related. Um, have you guys seen this AI high school photo trend? Uh, yes, I think I have. It's when you upload your fi pictures of your face and then it gives you like, oh. yeah, like oh, if, it, if you were like popular in high school. Right. Yeah. And so everyone's posting this and I didn't think anything of it. Or, no, the immediate thing I thought of it was, didn't we all as a society get mad about AI photo trends yeah like yeah. six months ago yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. and then like, like no these people look cool so yeah. that's yeah. Fine. I, yeah. it's like and i don't even um i think it's just in, in interesting how quickly ai discourse has evolved i don't know to what degree there is any potential art theft happening here you know what i mean sure. right but and if there is then that's bad obviously i'm i'm anti art theft mm -hmm. but anything ai related like this used to immediately you'd have to address it you have to right. be like, oh, i'm sorry i did the ai app yeah yeah um i didn't know <laughs> i thought it was just fun <laughs> or whatever and then it's been like 45 seconds and then and now, now it's fine every, it's hard to ignore how sick it is <laughs> <laughs> i know it's difficult to get around that. i guess if it makes you look cooler then it's fine it kind yeah. of feels like that when it's epic bacon then <laughs> yeah. yeah i still like i i'm not gonna run and do an ai trend because i don't know the whole history with the company and because i know that there's so many you know um there's so many opportunities for there to be a company doing bad stuff you know yeah. it's like we could very well hear next week that it's like oh yeah the ai high school situation yeah they, they actually stole a truck of the 1970s <laughs> high school photos or whatever yeah. <laughs> and they had to sacrifice children into a printer <laughs> yeah and that's how they got the photo like it's yeah. like yeah i don't know right um but i i'm still steering clear of it but i just want to say that i'm not passing like immediate judgment on anyone i just noticed that i could have sworn that everyone was like anti never do this again yeah. um, i know it's doesn't it cost money too? I think it does cost money, but I mean the pictures are cool. Yeah, so, yeah, so, so, so <laughs> yeah. you're not accounting for the swag equity. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> in Bidenomics, there's a lot of weight put on swag. <laughs> yeah. I was yeah. Uh, staunchly AI until a few, <laughs> that's not true, but I was staunchly <laughs> AI until a few days ago where I did generate a very funny and accurate image of Crash Bandicoot leading Antifa. <laughs> <laughs> and then you were that's like, funny. maybe this AI stuff is actually okay this is pretty after tight. All. Yeah, I saw one, I saw some pictures I, sometimes you see some AI stuff and you're like, fuck, that's awesome. I have a feeling I know what you're going to say. Is it the Steve Harvey yes! ones? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I felt. Dude, uh, have you seen them? Which one? Oh, it's, it's man. It's like Steve Harvey getting chased by like forest cryptids. Like, <laughs> and they look so real. <laughs> yeah, dude, they are fun. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. He, um, uh, he strikes a very, with his super white teeth and his super dark yeah. mustache, he strikes a very good silhouette. He does yeah, have a yeah. shot. He's yeah. got a good face for uh, for AI stuff. It's like <laughs> you'll, yeah. he's <laughs> yeah, the, a, the AI could figure it out immediately. He's got a good face for the forest. They're still trying to craft your mullet right now, but the technology <laughs> immediately It'll clocked be. Steve Harvey's mustache. <laughs> the PC is just whirring and the smoke coming out. <laughs> Get um, on. It's like you can hear these pictures too. <laughs> yeah, you can. I, I, oh like my high, I, I also hear like a high pitched squeal or screech, <laughs> and then I hear the um. The leaves cracking, under, yeah. crackling under his feet, and the classic Steve Harvey yell. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like when something's funny, but this time, right, it's not funny, it's and that's what makes funny. it so creepy. Mm -hmm. My favorite Steve Harvey noise is when someone on feud will like say the only obvious answer, mm. and they've been set up for it to be kind of risque. Yeah, yeah. and it's like, what's something in your pants <laughs> that's long, and when you're excited, it's hard, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then you know, like a seventy-five year old. I was just like a penis. And he's like, oh my god! Oh my he god. like he walks away. You so fucking like, he like sluts. takes off his coat. He has someone <laughs> fan him off screen. <laughs> he's, he's like doing a comical walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, I can't do that with my Lord. nose. I need to be careful. <laughs> it falls off. Um, uh, oh yeah, I should. Uh, I'll, I'll submit these for review. Um, I don't know if we've. We could, we could show, maybe we could show some of them. Uh, I did get somewhat super mad into uh, generating AI art on the Bing creator okay. when I was sat in the airport. There's a Bing creator? Bing has, I guess, Oh, right, because they work with Dali, OpenAI. Maybe. But I... Oh, wow. Well. It, I, I... I believe, uh, for, for uh, context, I believe... Uh, Microsoft invested like a hundred million dollars in OpenAI, the company that owns like Chat GPT or created Dolly. Chat GPT mm -hmm. and Dolly and stuff. So I think that they have some sort of partnership and it's used in Bing. Like we did that uh uh move that the the movie Showtimes conversation. Oh yeah, that's that was right. through Bing yeah. uh, AI. Um I did have quite a bit of success with some of them. One of which was um a human baby with but with all the powers of a monster truck okay. and it did pretty accurately fuse a human baby oh, and a monster whoa. truck yeah, whoa. somewhat convincing that me. feels like something that would be in twisted metal yeah for sure <laughs> do you yeah. remember that yeah, yeah. I half baby half, <laughs> half truck. baby half metal <laughs> Do you guys know the one that we can't show it? I'll just show it directly to you and if people can find it if they need to. Okay. Do you see the one that got Drake removed from viable search terms? You cannot use Drake in the Bing Dali search. No. no. Because, and having used it, it's pretty strict on what you're able to get away with. It, it'll even just interpret the contents of the image even if none of the language was bad and block it sometimes. Okay. I don't know how someone got this. But I guess with enough workarounds and adjectives. Yeah, it's one of those yeah. things because like every every chat GPT thing, there's always like somebody said that massaged it the right way and then got it to say like mm. the worst hate crime ever. Right. This is like crazy. And I, I completely understand why they don't want to. I'm really excited to see it. What? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> That's not at all what I was expecting, no. but it's so strange. It's, they, I mean, yeah, I'll, be able, I'll just say they made an, an image where Drake is doing something extremely racist. Yeah. yeah. And it's like, it's a story about it all. It's that yeah, yeah. Right, right. Yeah, AI did this. <laughs> he should have done that. Drake the, Drake the type of guy to be super racist. <laughs> Damn. What a rough time for Drake that was yeah. when that one meme was peak. Was I saw like, a really funny one the other day. It was like, uh, it's like the 
all those like cartoonish ones about Drake and it was the one the one I saw it was like Drake's the type of guy to catch a boot while fishing <laughs> <laughs> Drake the type of guy to shake a tree in a bee's nest for yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that one got me really good that's so funny the one that always stuck in my brain was uh, Drake the type of guy to go into a barber pull up Pinterest and say like this <laughs> um, I, I love that meme this is such an old meme but the one where um the it's like the guy has shows a picture to a barber and then it's the photo of oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Buzzes yeah. Really yeah. Really yeah. i like yeah. don't think it's real i think it, it is like ai generated or just graphic design done mm-hmm. but it's still funny it's a dumb joke it's so funny and dumb jokes are funny sometimes um do we we have I mean, we talked about it a little bit before the show, so maybe we can just reiterate it. Or maybe everything's been covered, but the Sniper Wolf stuff is interesting. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Any, yeah sniper at wolf. time of recording, it was what? Like, not even like 12 hours ago? This is yeah. last night. Yeah. yeah. Right? Last night. Yeah. Yeah. So I guess for context, uh, Jack's Films uh, has been doing a lot of content about Sniper Wolf. I think initially started because uh was talking about like how does sniper wolf get away with like non-transformatively sure. reacting to other people's content um and then created a like bingo style game of which i am uh everyone talks to me tells me about because i did darman bingo for a long time on my stream uh and and i think it's like based on like sniper wolf tropes um maybe they don't know that bingo was a game <laughs> right. like, Before, you yeah. invented, I think if, if he uses Bingo Baker, I I will take credit for popularizing Bingo Baker. Um, and I'll take his money. <laughs> uh, but um, but then uh, I mean I think just things Sniper Wolf did respond at other points in time. There, mm-hmm. I remember there was a video that Jackson did like Sniper Wolf, but every every time something happens, I read a tweet she sent me tonight, which is a very funny title for yeah. a video. Um, I but that. I didn't watch it. Yeah. But then, um, so yeah, there was some responding back and forth and I don't want to like cast judgment on, I haven't actually seen Jack's content on Sniper Wolf. I just know that there's a lot of it and that personally like gave me a little bit of a weird vibe. Mm. But, uh, but I'm friends with Jack. I've like known Jack for years and I've worked with him before. So I'm biased. Um, but then last night, Sniper Wolf posted an Instagram story where she was like, my shoot is really close to Jack's film's house. Should I go say hi? She posted that on her Instagram story. It was like, she's like, it's like five minutes away from my. So she asked her followers. Oh, yeah. So it's on them. Yeah. No. yeah. And then she posted an unblurred photo of the front of his house on Instagram stories. With and the was caption, like, uh, let's talk like adults, adults or whatever. Okay. Yeah. That's yeah. the adult way to do yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That, yeah, I tracked you down like a grown up. So I, like, <laughs> yeah. I will say because I, I am not, I have not <laughs> consumed all of Jack's films or really any of his content about Sniper Wolf. So I don't know what type of stuff was inside of it. I can only say optically from like the outside, but it is not okay. <laughs> this should be obvious mm-hmm. to post someone's house <laughs> to your 33 million followers yeah. <laughs> or however many followers she has on Instagram. It's a lot. How does she even have his address? Like, how that, does she? Yeah. Who's just like, oh yeah. <laughs> like he, someone just DMs you, by the way, just in case yeah, you need it. Your shoot's training. right by a... Uh, your shoot is right by his house. <laughs> There's a collab they were doing. <laughs> that would be the perfect. That would, what an elegant little ending that would be for the, all the drama. <laughs> okay, 5.6 million followers on Instagram. Still a lot. Yeah. That's still enough. Oh, is she posting shit about more. it? Yeah, she put. And so again, it's a little bit of a back and forth right now. And I don't. I'm trying to be diplomatic here. I don't want to wholly paint a person at on either side as bad but i will say i don't agree with certain actions uh sniper wolf posted you i stepped in shit and then people who talk it shit in dms and then suddenly become the victim when i say something mean back what that, that what the fuck 
You didn't say something mean, but <laughs> showed up to his house and yeah. posted it to five million people. And then Jack, this is like the, I feel like the closest we ever got to drama, <laughs> but I think the <laughs> ultimate yeah. act is like, don't do this. Like doxing is never okay. It's a huge, yeah. it's a huge um, safety hazard. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, and also there's people involved that are at risk that are not just Jack. He lives with his wife, right? And, yeah. you know what I mean? Like um, his wife, Aaron and their dogs. And like, it's like not, I don't know. It, it's just, it's a very out of line move. And it's also odd that there's to at least so far, and I think, you know, quite possibly never any repercussions on the part of YouTube or any kind of punishment yeah. done by mm -hmm. YouTube for this kind of behavior. A lot of people, I've seen a lot of people, they were like tagging YouTube and like the YouTube creators page yeah. to be like this, because they always promote Sniper Wolf and yeah. shit. So it's like, yeah, they do. So it makes sense to be like, yo, this person on your platform is like doxing other YouTubers. Yeah. And so, and so then uh, Jack tweeted uh, that he that she doxed her and said it was violating and gross, whatever. Um, and then he kind of made his points about stealing content. But then she posted that and said, this creep has been harassing me for months, then plays victim saying I threatened him when I just wanted to talk to him. <laughs> I have All I did was tell people his address <laughs> and he's being weird. Like, he's to be clear, she posted an unblurred photo of his house. His yeah. like, house number is there. You can just figure out where he That's lives. That's not, yeah, that doesn't mean you want to talk. Yeah, yeah. that is like a pretty threatening. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, like a sniper scope image of you having dinner. Like, I <laughs> just want to hang out, man. That's like what a serial killer in a movie does. <laughs> yeah. That's what the um, sniper in Sniper Wolf whoa, is. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. I just want to talk. Um, I feel like you, you've just generally been pretty insulated from that kind of like online conflict stuff in like i don't remember a curtis rivalry or war yeah yeah i don't think i can't really remember one either i mean i i also haven't and commentary definitely has like a degree of uh, yeah distance at least from like influencer yeah com competitiveness maybe is the best way to put it yeah i don't think i've ever i'm trying to think if there's anything that was like I know there was like a little bit with like fresh and fit, but like that yeah. was like all they did was like make some like TikToks and they're about awesome. Me. Yeah. So, yeah. I'm yeah. genuinely a fan of them. Jealous, so. I guess is the problem. Um, yeah. I was just mad that they yeah. were upset that you know they're mad at me. <laughs> you know, what's really funny is the, the people, yeah, fresh and fit got mad at you. Mm -hmm. uh, Logan Paul's Pokemon slash crypto guy. Mm -hmm got oh, mad yeah. at me collectibles guru collectibles guru sent me a bunch of dms saying i was lying <laughs> uh and then he went and did another crypto scam <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> just to prove this is what it would look like yeah, if yeah. i did do it see <laughs> yeah he told me i was i was i was like demeaning his good name or whatever okay. and then he went on to defraud more millions <laughs> yeah, yeah. of dollars so nice. he's fine good i of course i'm a frequent and consistent victim of the Iggy Azalea stan culture. Right, right. This has happened in the past, which I did not know existed <laughs> until I entered the fray. <laughs> it's um, a war I didn't know was happening. Yeah. This uh, Iggy Azalea thing. I want to finish this <laughs> new Sniper Wolf message because it is interesting to me. I have no ill intentions, period. Wait, Sniper Wolf said this? Okay. It's oh, so sad when scenario. people have to constantly create drama to pay their bills. And I'm like, I, I do feel... So first of all, neither of these people have to create drama to pay their bills. They're doing just fine uh, without without drama. And historically, like I don't know that Jack has been in drama. Uh, and I again am not like saying that it, his actions are perfect here, but I don't know that he has a history of like picking fights with creators. This is this seemed very out of character, which is kind of surprising to me. But. Um, but then also, at any point, you it, posting this after posting his house is wild to me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You kind of lose any sort of ground to stand on yeah. if you do that. Sort of, I, I have like more respect for just some old school villainy. Yeah, like don't don't try and backtrack now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go full full tilt with it. Yeah, Go crazy. Here's Leave the address it. again, by the way. Yeah, <laughs> I'll be there right now. <laughs> I want to chat. Yeah, I'm doing a meetup. <laughs> <laughs> it's your house. <laughs> <laughs> doing a sniper wolf meetup at Jack's film's house. <laughs> <This> um, <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty crazy that that was her response of like, of, because like the, his whole bit was like, 
I think I think it was like I think the reason he was doing so many videos about her is like the parody of her style of content of uploading so much. Yeah, right. Saying, like, and all the lazy. thumbnails of her like him like yeah. hogging and you know, yeah, like, yeah. So I think I you see what he was going for, obviously, but and I think I think a lot of stuff was developing the past few weeks and months where it yeah. was like like bubbling. Yeah, and like people were, she was like cutting stuff out of videos because people were like finally claiming that of their own TikToks and stuff. And like, yeah, a lot of people were like finding weird stuff about her videos. So I think yeah. it was probably just reached like a, a tipping point where she yeah, was like. Yeah, it's like, I, I have to acknowledge that like, um, I don't want to seem like we're taking any harassment of women lightly mm -hmm. here. Right. And, and also like, it's it's tough because sniper wolf has a gigantic platform but is also a person and is like it's not like because i've done darman bingo and i did it for a long time and the only reason i stopped was because um uh out of solidarity with the striking uh darman mm. actors who right. got fired by him and which is another like i guess swirling element related to sniper wolf is that she still frequently does Darman collabs. True. There's neither here nor there, but that's just an interesting kind True. of like through line. Mm -hmm. But but yeah, so so it's like for me, I was like making fun of the show and 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 the tropes of a show that is like written and produced and we right. were never like making fun of the actors or anything like that. But um I have to noodle on like it like the, I totally see where you're coming from where it's like making fun of the volume of the content. Mm -hmm. But it optically can you know, I, I can totally understand if with, like if you're a woman online and you see this dude's just making like yeah, 30 yeah. videos about yeah that's a bad a look for sure. it's a, ba it's a yeah. bad look and it's like no I, I shit my pants ironically <laughs> it's like it's a yeah. pit. I shit all over the floor yeah and it's like I um again like uh I know Jack so maybe I'm giving him too much of the benefit of the doubt like I'm biased uh, but I haven't spoken to him in a long time mm -hmm. um so I don't I don't know anything about this but um, with all that being said, the latest post on Sniper Wolf's Instagram is a selfie with we show up to your house, W-Y-D. Okay. So Who, who's the other person? Is that bro? maybe a sister or something? Oh, okay. But <laughs> it's Jag. I don't know if like making light of that this moment it's it, it, it's like what is a very serious action is maybe the right path forward you know oh like that like being like there, making yeah. a meme of like we show up to your house yeah. what do you do right we, be concerned yeah, yeah uh, maybe be pretty bummed actually yeah. reach out to youtube probably <laughs> yeah. first and foremost i'll be right back you guys keep talking all right oh i don't like this Oh, mm. oh, this sucks. This is stupid. Ow. Ow. You, it hurts. Do you ever get people pushing you to move to LA? Um, Sometimes, yeah. I'm not pushing. I think a lot of people are like, I think people vastly exaggerate how awesome it is out here to try yeah. to get me to move here. It's nice. But like, <laughs> yeah. I really like being in Toronto. <laughs> yeah. I really like being in my house with, <laughs> with my wife and my dog. It's actually fine. They can't go. It's actually great. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's just me. Uh, yeah. There's a lot of, I mean, it's usually it comes from people who are like, you know, trying to be like supportive. It's like people at like an agency or something. <laughs> Dipper. Mr. Di well, well, well. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I know Dipper wants me to move to LA. Was it you and me that talked about like you? You'd never notice that all of your road signs have like a crown on them. <laughs> yeah, I've no, I'd never <laughs> noticed that. Yeah. And everyone, we've had other friends like stay with us, and they say they point out to like, I love the crown, and it's like, why the fuck? How does how do people notice? It? I've never. Yeah, it's seen a road them. sign. They have. <laughs> yeah, know, that's like, just how they are. I guess that's all you ever would have known. Yeah. Yeah. Either. They always, and then I come here, and it's like. These aren't royal roads at all. <laughs> this <is> bumpy. <laughs> yeah. These Where is she? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's Help. weird. Do you I have the know. queen on money? We have the queen on money. Jesus. I think that she's on the 20. I think she's on the $20 bill. I have such bad news, but. <laughs> what? She bit the bullet. <laughs> That's not real. She was. She didn't win the election. <laughs> She lost to that little baby or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> little baby? Liz Truss. Oh. I'm talking about Liz Truss. Oh, okay. 
Like uh, a little baby, the rapper. Well, they, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the <to, to> baby one. <laughs> uh, no, do you, I mean, so in the UK, you currently have to, I don't know, there's like a deadline at some point. Uh, I think it's next year where oh, yeah, you have they to have... trade in all your money. Right. With cash. The current kings maybe not got that long, mm. not a threat, <laughs> but like maybe not got, you know, many decades left. And then it, I believe the baby becomes king or whatever, the <laughs> yeah. little baby. At which point, Don't. can we get a baby on the money? Yeah, yeah, baby true. Baby no money? Baby, <laughs> baby, baby yes money. Yeah. Baby, baby yes some money. money. <laughs> yeah, I wonder. Because be so I feel sick. like it would go down in value, I feel like, if there was a, if a, if the <laughs> currency had a baby on it. Just a little kid. <laughs> it's like worth less, I think. Yeah, because that is just having images of someone else's child with <laughs> yeah. you all the time. Yeah. In your wallet. <laughs> <laughs> you want to see the <laughs> pictures of my, my baby? That's a fiver. Look at my boy. <laughs> <laughs> I always forget that like most dogs are huge. Yeah. And like, I'm, I'm so used to my tiny little dog. Yeah, I see a yeah. big dog. I'm like, how are you the same animal? <laughs> it's I, so dude, weird. Yeah. <laughs> We're like, Kiwi could get, I'm like scared sometimes when I see like a big bird fly in my back. So he could like pick Kiwi up and I'd never see him again. <laughs> Have you ever seen an Alaskan Malamute? Uh, oh, no, I don't think so. They are, they I, look. They look like a car. They, yeah, <laughs> they look like an Arcanine. Like it's like, yeah, they look like a legendary Pokemon. Um, and I remember one time, like Dipper is like a pretty confident dog. Mm -hmm. I remember one time he like saw a Malamute for the first time. He was much smaller, but his eyes went back and he was like, what the <laughs> fuck is that? <laughs> Cthulhu. Yeah. Pure terror. He was like, there's no way we are the same species. Yeah. It's weird that you take Different. them to the same like person, He's like the same down, kind so. of doctor. It's like a Whoa. gigantic husky. Holy shit. Um, Whoa, yeah, damn. Seeing next to a person is crazy. Yeah, some dogs are too big, I'll say. That's it. not a dog. Yeah, yeah. That's, you could put a saddle on yeah. it. Yeah, it looks like it's really close to the lens. It would be so <laughs> sick if you were like a kid. I don't know if that would hurt their backs or whatever, so don't get on me if this is animal cruelty. Mm -hmm. But like in my head, in the cartoon mind that I have, it would be so sick to have like a little baby like riding yeah, it. Right at the yeah, riding to school. Yeah. yeah. Or like a little monkey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> riding it to school. <laughs> <laughs> monkey school. Um, Diff. He's laughing at the idea. <laughs> He's re literally r ruffling. He right used now. to hate being on his back, and now he just like lies around on his back, or he'll like run up to you and like show you his belly. And oh, it's like wow. very sweet. I'm like very happy about it because okay. I think it just means he's gotten comfortable. Yeah, I think he, that's why he, they say that dogs do that. Yeah, I don't know how to, they would know that, but he used to be very. <laughs> they tell him. <laughs> right, I've got information. <laughs> <laughs> they do like an exit interview. Yeah. Um. But anyway, I I need to ignore him or else this podcast will just become about him. Oh yeah, which is just how which is people like that. No, yeah. <laughs> we, we, he's purlins. got enough podcasts dedicated to him. <laughs> um, what is the Will Smith drama? Oh, this. So this is something I added because I thought um, it's something that has been kind of on in the online discourse for so long. And recently, and obviously it escalated with the Oscar slap, but then, um, so ever since the Oscar slap, I feel like there's a certain type of dude online, usually who's like, women just want to tear dudes down oh, yeah. uh, who are like, yeah. who are like, this woman hates Will Smith and she never, cause she like always talks about Tupac cause her and Tupac like dated and stuff. Yeah. Um, and then, but then recently recently uh jada pinkett smith started doing like a press tour where she's like gone on record and has been like will and i have been separated since 2016. what did he hit <laughs> oh, just his face on the, <laughs> <on> the chair <laughs> <laughs> oh tim you okay you smack your face you silly guy he's all right um, so she's been going around saying that they're not yeah, it's together. like it's like okay they've been separated since 2016 and then every other interview headline i see is like she says in an interview that like tupac is her true soul bait and stuff mm -hmm. and i'm like why is this why are there so many head like why is everybody why is she doing so many interviews and yeah. why are they all about this like usually a press tour is to like promote something yeah that you have coming out who's your but. soulmate and it's like, I, cause i'm so personally like allergic to like immediately jumping on that bandwagon of mm -hmm. like whatever but i'm like i i'm like what is the purpose of all of this yeah what is the press store for um but what is the press store for 
I don't know. It, well, what was? I, I, don't, <laughs> yeah, I don't actually know. Fresh but that's the thing. It's like if if you're on a press tour or something and all the headlines are about how you don't like Will Smith, then it's like, yeah. d- is it uh, effective? <laughs> it, or, or is that a failure in the media? I don't know. I, I don't want to, again, pass judgment where I don't know enough, but I just found it so wild that like... It is pretty fr- interesting. I saw, yeah, I saw like one quote from her, I guess, was that was like they were like long split up when yeah. the slap happened i guess right and she was like oh he said my wife and it's like we haven't called each other husband and wife for like so many years right and i was like oh damn that's crazy but kind also of a romantic like, gesture we know yeah. far too much about this family yeah, it's really <laughs> strange. Sure. yeah. that's <laughs> the like, weird part about um i guess just like when you get to that level of celebrity i think there's like there you i guess you kind of have to talk about your personal life that much it's like do you, I it's guess. just weird because yeah. that's like the last thing I would ever do. Yeah, is be like talk about the inner workings of my family and relationships. In your relationships, yeah. Yeah. especially when like your stock and trade, the thing that got you to that level, is yeah. pretending to be not you. Yeah, you're like you're, oh, you're, yeah. You're, you're yeah. yeah. Me and Jen actually you. haven't called yeah. each other honey bears since 2016. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 like she is everything yeah. okay? Yeah. 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 Exactly. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, I'm still extremely rich. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just so weird to be in that. I don't, yeah, I can't even imagine being that level of famous and then yeah, it's having scary. everyone talk about your relationship like that. Yeah. And, and they're not helping it. They're not helping it because like they've also like made their kids famous and stuff too. Yeah. Like, I don't and they had that show where they just like had did like a like a family therapy thing where oh, they just like talked about each other. Right. It was like family meetings but televised. Isn't it like red red table talk or something like something that? Something like yeah. yeah. That is truly brain broken like, <laughs> yeah. that requires so much exposure to an audience to the point where you forget that the audience is also people and that it's strange yeah that there are people that don't do that that like when you market your children by naming them after yourself like you know yeah. what i mean when the marketing begins at conception <laughs> yeah. then yeah. it's like well if we're gonna have family therapy what we're not gonna monetize it yeah it's it is kind of funny it's like, like i don't know why they why the uh the smiths named all their kids after their names you know like will low mm-hmm. Jaden. Jaden. Yeah. um and then there's the other one too who's like uh will smith jr or fresh what's his i don't remember <laughs> what his actual name is because he's the one that's not uh, yeah, his name is legend he's not the he's not the one <laughs> yeah, I, am I am legend, legend. Ian legend. <laughs> <laughs> he's the one son who's not like super active in hollywood but right. he was in like the just the two of us video and Dude, stuff that's the dream but <laughs> i know is to get is to be cropped out of photos with them <laughs> yeah. you know you get to go to the premiere but if someone sees you they're like is he a backup dancer for someone or? right yeah like the but he was with will's previous wife it's like that like, third uh you got you guys know the property <laughs> brothers <laughs> yeah you guys know of the, him you, Oh, you know of them? You know, the know, th- know you know of, of the third, the secret property brother, the third one, and like the bonus Jonas. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> there's the third or? property brother, and he's like emo. Whoa, whoa, can you, yeah. You got? Can you look up the third, the extra property brother? <laughs> he hates houses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's homeless. He's an anarchist. Doesn't yeah. believe in private property. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, that's all. Wait, he looks cool. <laughs> He's badass. He's like the bad brother. Yeah. Whoa. There's the other, the bonus one. Is he? Relax. They're not triplets, right? Uh, no, I don't think so. Oh, cause they're twins. Yes. Dang. That's rough though. If you're like a kid minding your own business, I don't know who was first, but imagine you're a kid minding your own business and then your mom is like twins. And yeah. You're like, what? what? Everyone's going to love you're them making, more. Yeah, you're making yeah. two best friends. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're, like, you're making me a third wheel. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> you, you hired two best friends. <laughs> um, well, at least they aren't going to become famous. Oh, <laughs> oh no. And, they're, and part of the fact that their fame is that they're brothers, that and brothers. people are just going to assume that I don't <laughs> exist. Yeah, he's like emo, though. He kind of looks like a... Yeah, he, he's oh, got, yeah, that's a good one. He's got Anthony Padilla's haircut from... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> shout out, by the way. Shout out. Yeah, shout out, Anthony. Um, Which way look at the image Ian next and to Anthony that. both have COVID right now, so get get well soon, fellas. Dude, look at the oh, pic damn. to the left of that, where it's just the property brothers have one and two next to them, and then the one in the middle just has <laughs> <laughs> We don't know what the fuck this guy is. <laughs> we don't know. I don't even know if there's numbers between them. <laughs> <laughs> 
What the? F- that's such a weird way to label a picture. Yeah. That truly does look like they don't know how to count. <laughs> yeah. One yeah. fucking something, something two. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> One C. <laughs> God damn, the property brothers are so handsome. And this guy too, hey, don't, you know. Yeah, the third one is, he's got his own thing going on. That's also, there's a picture of Pete Wentz there. I don't know why he, why he was there. But. <laughs> what is going on? It's AI. Yeah, but that's, um, there's another property, bro. Um, Do you think you'd be incentivized to get into property development? If, because, okay, he does look like the youngest. So I feel like mm, yeah. to have two older brothers who are property uh a management moguls I, mm-hmm. I would definitely feel a lot of pressure you know I'd have the, to get into the family biz the family legacy mm-hmm. he goes off to live in the woods <laughs> forget this yeah you've gotta you're like what is the opposite yeah what's the opposite of real estate <laughs> living underground <laughs> <laughs> yeah he becomes a crab person <laughs> he's the um uh he's the pyromaniac brother <laughs> just levels houses in the ground yeah. I yeah. destroy property <laughs> no yeah he has no, a goatee please. he's the evil one yeah he's got like a bulldozer doing fucking. that little line of fatigue too <laughs> like a cartoonish <laughs> yeah every time his his brothers fix a house he demolishes it it's weird I, that TNT's real do you know what I mean doesn't that oh, seem yeah. like from cartoons yeah and it just actually, looks it does it look Tannerite like that right or is that is that something else? What uh, DNT? Is that Michael Douglas? Yeah, um, it is. I'm gonna cool. try these Kit Kats, by the way. Oh please! A little muck, ah, little wait, muck man, bang. Little muck bang. Dipper, do you want chocolate? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I have a second gift. I have a Pokemon related gift. Oh what? Whoa what? I don't know, Curtis, if you have, have already acquired one. But I have Mr. Mimes to trade. Mm. They are a European exclusive Pokemon. I do want that. For some reason. I guess France, maybe. Whoa. They do that. Why. There's okay, that regional, makes sense. Regional exclusive. But if you guys need to fill out your Pokedexes. <laughs> and this is for Pokemon Go? Yeah. I Pokemon want your, Go. I want your Mime Jr. For the, the low, low price of, I mean, anything, I'm not doing well. Any cash I can, you can kind of throw my way <laughs> would actually mean a lot. Okay, I'll re download it because I haven't downloaded it yet. I didn't have Mr. Mime, so I was like, what's the point? Dude, tomorrow's community day. We're going to get Liddy. Hi, buddy. Oh, uh-oh. How I many steps hey, do you... Hey. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, of all the things to knock over, that was a good choice. Yeah, good good choice. All right. Do you get a lot more steps now that you play Pokemon <laughs> Go? The graphs are crazy. I mean, I just had my surgery, so I was like not moving, but... Um, well, the Pokemon died. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, come back. We need you. Spin a Pokestop, please. Uh, check this out. What do you <laughs> spot on this graph when I started playing Pokemon Go. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like for, I, I was averaging like 33,000 steps a day, which is like, whoa, like it was a lot of miles. It was like at least 10, 10, 10 or more miles a week. Holy shit. Or a day. Um, That's like a half marathon. I know. Yeah, <laughs> I was, I, I, I was walking a lot. I, I, I'm toning it down, but like the past, like if we go to this week, I've started getting back into it. And, <laughs> nice. Uh-oh, that, that can't be real. That's next. 42,000 right. steps? That can't be right. Yeah. Uh, oh, wait, this is September. Yo, that probably did happen, actually. Whoa. For That was a crazy day. Uh, but wait, let me go back. Yeah, so like this is where I'm at right now because I'm easing back into it. Okay. Tomorrow's going to be crazy, though. But because we uh, were on our Pokemon shit recently, uh, we played a game last, last episode where I found a Guess That Pokemon quiz game. Mm-hmm. And because Jordan's like... Uh, obviously like familiar with Pokemon but wasn't like a, a mega Pokemon nerd like I am mm-hmm. it was like really fun to like put put his knowledge to the test mm, and I no he, need to he, check yeah I don't check it pretty good <laughs> but he did list he said Agumon for a lot of the answers <laughs> and it was that was wrong I like where your head's at I think you're right <laughs> yeah I hey, think that's right head cannon mm-hmm. <laughs> crossover <laughs> um Naruto <laughs> <laughs> um, Inuyasha. Can we pull up the, uh, <laughs> the whole show? <laughs> can we pull up the game? Do you have okay. So there's nine generations of Pokemon. That's God. entirely too many. Yeah, but you can choose which generations you want to be quizzed on. Okay. Do you have a comfort zone? I'd say anything after like Gen four is like dicey for me. Mm. So we'll select Gens one through four for you. Okay. Um, yeah, I think I could do that. Dude, what Pokemon is that? 
That's who is that Pokemon? Oh yeah, and we can do we can do easy so that you don't have to guess the silhouette. But yeah, and then can you do I don't know on this one because I want to. Okay, oh, it is oh, yeah, okay, I yeah. thought it was, but uh, the things spiky. on its arms are weird. No, that's anti. All right, well, so so <laughs> so we'll uh, take off generation two. No. Um, uh, how should we do five or? Well, how about this? We'll do five with gens one through four, mm-hmm. and then we'll do uh, we'll do five for gens five through nine, and see if you get a single okay, one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, how much money you want to put down on this? Or? But oh, you put money on it? Yeah. Let's oh, skip. Damn. Let's skip. Uh, yeah, at home, guess oh, the over under. What if you get less than five? We you don't release a special. Yeah, you actually okay. have to release our special <laughs> okay the day after you left the theater we walked in <laughs> and recorded an hour and 11 minutes damn, damn it you'll notice know, yeah, some of the bigger like, they told us it was the longest day <laughs> set recorded ever done you'll notice know, on some of the biggest laughs if you check the footage it's, they're laughing because we're behind you going <laughs> right like making yeah. fun of you <laughs> yeah you guys are doing silly faces behind <laughs> me all right so let's do i don't know for this one so you can start fresh Plus, you knew that one. That's yeah. a gimme. All right. Okay. So that is Polly Wag. Yep. Uh, yeah. Forgiving spelling. Nice. One hundred percent hit rate so far. <laughs> okay. Nice. Who's that guy? Uh, that is. Oh man. Say it with confidence. Pika. It's fucking. You got it, dude. Agu- I I do know it. You know sucks. it. You for yeah. sure know it. Um, Look, if you need a hint. It's very got, funny posture. I've got a few hints I can throw your way. That's uh <sighs> Yeah, throw me in. Throw me in. <laughs> Do you want to know the letter it starts with? Yeah. Okay. P. Is it Piplup? It is Piplup. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, That's yeah. what I was leaning towards, but yeah, I wasn't. Yeah, yeah. Okay, sick. A okay. 200% hit rate. Ooh. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> That's <laughs> That's uh, that's like bee uh, beehive lady. Beatrice. Be- yeah, beehive lady's real close. Uh, it's so, behave. Be- um, Ooh. Yeah. It's, it's Beyonce. Yeah. Uh, so Bay. so this Pokemon, it's Gen Four. It evolves from Combi. Uh, Combi currently spawning a Pokemon Go Harvest Festival event. Look it up. Combi. So this has got to be some sort of variation on that. It's got to be like actually no. Oh, unfortunately, damn. yeah, you would Rats. not guess it. Combussy or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. How did you know? <laughs> no, this is uh, Vespa Quinn. Okay, Ooh. fuck. It's the I, yeah. Queen B. I definitely yeah. like battled a couple of these. No, it's fucking, one. It's one that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've definitely encountered it, but zero fuck, percent. All right, that's Pichu. Zero percent. Yeah. Right. Was it? Is that our fourth one? Yeah, that's Let's just now. do this one last. This is our last one for this round. And that's Jinx. <laughs> the Ooh. racism Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> it rocks. The Pokemon's just... <laughs> so nice, they changed it twice. Uh, and that's Espeon. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah, All right, we know you know these guys. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's do let's do Gen 5 through... That's unknown R. Relax. Relax. Yeah, or is it P? I can tell yeah, you. Yeah. <laughs> um, let's do Gen 5 through 9, and you just got to name oh, one. Man. <laughs> okay. Th- this, is, this is like that, uh, that SNL skit with Bill Hader and John Belady, where it's like, um, it's your wife's best friend. Oh, yeah. What is her name? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, okay. This is a starter. Gen 9 starter. Yeah. Brand new. Uh, fuck. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> is it fuck? Final answer. So, <laughs> yeah. so close. Uh, yeah, weird. Okay, so there was Quaxley and there yeah. was Fuego. Co- Go? Yeah, so that's two of three I, of the Gen 9. Yeah, wow. so I'm trying the, to think of the, the other bad one. news is that's not this one. <laughs> yeah, so you're like, I'm, you know, I feel like I want to give you a point three points or something <laughs> for, for that. <laughs> and it's like, is it like... Ooh? Ooh? It's with an S, Ooh. right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is it, you're like, you're like, is it... <laughs> I could do if I could do <laughs> yeah. say every sound. And then says... Swear to ABC. One, two, three, four. I know it's an S. It's uh, like... Is it S star... Like... Uh, s- <laughs> 
Shut I don't know. It's like freaking slimy or something. <laughs> That's it. It is it's a little slimy. Kind of slimy. I'm trying to wonder what to sort of tip I could give you. Um, would you want the rhythm of the name? The rhythm of the <laughs> night. Uh, would you want the rhythm of the name? Like I give you the syllables and maybe sure. how it sounds. Or I could give you the next letter. Uh, Hit me with the next letter. P. All right. It's fuck. <laughs> I've, 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 yes. Slimy. <laughs> Is it like uh? Well, there's got to be a fucking sphinx sphincter. <laughs> sphincter. sphincter. <laughs> Throw a sphincter. Okay, I'll me. give you the other hint. It's uh, Bagabibo. Oh, Sprigatito. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's funny that you got two letters, but making a nonsense sound was like. <laughs> yeah. I just knew because it's like, it, it's how you say it. Yeah. Oh, God. Okay. This guy, this one's got to be like. Uh, this one's got the one of the easiest to guess Pokemon names. Right. It's got to be like Ducky or something. Or yeah. Like this one is fuck. <laughs> this, it this is. One. <laughs> yeah. Let's go Duxley or something. Duxley's good. It's Ducklet. Oh. But, which is like basically the same, you Damn, know? Damn, okay. That's like a Friday night at the Pokemon Company. We gotta get one done. <laughs> yeah, duck, duck link. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man, what the what hell? The I've hell never seen that? this one. Uh, I think this one's Scolipede. Uh, S-C-O-L-I-P-E-D-E. Oh, wow, damn. Guys, you I'm fucking just, nailed the spelling, I'm, too. Yeah, I'm kind of a god in Pokemon. <laughs> okay, this one is... You Dude, you keep dude. getting starters, but, like, the game loves you. Yeah, this one's, like, a fucking... Gen 5 starter, black and white, I think. Okay. Is it, like, Sploink or something? <laughs> <laughs> I think Sprigatito put you in a mindset. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, no, 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 no. No, because Sploink is a different pig Pokemon. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, I knew yeah, that was Sploink one. is the pig Pokemon that's on a uh, on a little spring. Okay, so this is like... But this uh, is a pig Pokemon. With kind of a little spring. <laughs> yeah. For a tail. Yeah. Kind of a little springy tail. Um, Swine... Ooh. Flu. <laughs> <laughs> You're thinking of Swine Up, which is an ice uh, another, ground uh, type Pokemon. Another. This is Tepig. Tepig, fuck. Yeah. yeah, you're right. Damn it, dude. <laughs> Swine flu. <laughs> oh, it's COVID. <laughs> this one's tough. This is Gen 9. Oh, uh, I remember seeing this one. Oh, okay. uh, it's got to be like... Uh, like K... Kane, Kane. I see. This one, honestly, the dog in its is not really present in its name. Like, I don't know where it, like, you don't think of this Pokemon with like a doggy type name. Right. It's more on the ghostly side of things. Okay. Ghost dog. Okay. Yeah. Ghost dog wear the samurai. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So it's like a, uh, hunt, hunt, hunty. Not a bad Go guess. Off uh, so this one is, I believe. There's, sorry, I mix it up with the evolution, but I think it's graveyard. Okay. Uh, like, uh, but uh, take out the Y, Jacob, and then, yeah, it's Grievard. Oh, Grievard. No. Okay. Oh, do you know that one? No. <laughs> do you know that one? I recognize it. It's a little uh, bastard. Looks like a. Oh no. I don't even know what the hell that thing is. It is, like, is, I don't, it's it like, is a, like AI. <laughs> it's like a... Um, is that its nose? Or it's, it's like that? meant to be like a nucleus or something like that. Uh, so okay. I'm trying to look at it in the clip. It, this is Solosis. Solosis. Uh, yeah. Okay, wait. Let me, let me just Let me jump. Can you do my... Oh, do you know that one? That, that's Sprigatito's third evolution. Oh, God. It's, this is tough. Gen I 9 is tough. Like, I, I don't even know Gen 9 that well. I remember fighting it in the, yeah. in the game. No, Gen 9 is... Because you haven't committed him to memory yet. You know what I mean? Right. Does it help if I tell you that the one I have in Pokemon Go's name is Buster? That's your name? Get the, <laughs> for the cat, for name my, for my okay. one, yeah. I, that doesn't help me at all. <laughs> no, it doesn't, okay, yeah. yeah. It shouldn't. Why would it... it Sprigatito. I'm going to go like... Sp, um, Splunkeridom. Splunker, Splunkeroo. Let's find out. Okay, that's close. It's Meowskerata. 
<laughs> That'd be fair. Right. That's on Sprigatier. Um, <laughs> that's Talonflame. All right, Jacob, could you do could you do me normal difficulty and then just do Gens one through nine? I want to do a couple. So these are like the silhouettes. These will just be silhouettes. Whoa! If I don't get it, you. Guys what the are... fuck is elite? Oh, it's the fucking cries. Oh yeah, <laughs> which oh, is insane. Fuck that. That's a uh, Daru. Uh, uh, is it Darumaka? Yeah, Darumaka. Oh, so he's got like a scary D a r u m a k a. Yeah. You. Wow. Yuck. Yeah. Okay. This wretched is, little creature. So this is the <laughs> evolution of Burmy, uh, which is. Name is escaping me. It's like uh, it reminds me of trash. Does it have like a trash like name? Um, Burmy evolves into it. I don't think it starts with Berm, but but it's like something. Tra- Why does trash keep coming into my mind? Because it's just steel. That sucks. No. Um, I think it's got to be. All right, wait. I'm gonna close my eyes. Do oh, wait, do you guys know it? <laughs> Spro. Yeah, we know it, but we'll let you go. Oh, okay, okay, wait. Okay, so wait. Yeah, you go. guys do. I don't know, and then tell me the first letter. W. It, the first letter is W. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> is it really? Yeah, it's W. Yeah. Okay. W W Pokemon. What's the What's the second letter? O. O. Yeah. O. O. Mm-hmm. What? Wormadam. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. <sighs> That what is, the hell is that? Jesus. That's Basque Legion, is my guess. So B A S, yeah, that's it. Looks like a Damn. Rorschach thing. <laughs> that was yeah, released in like, Legends Arceus. This is Boodoo. B U D E W. Like. Yeah, oh, he's cute. Uh-huh. Is that also supposed to be a um, nucleus. That is well, that's Floatzel. I thought. Wait, is that Weasel or Floatzel? I want to say Floatzel. It's because it's tall. Weasel's a little guy, right? Float is Z E L. Yeah. There we go. This is oh, the grossest Pokemon ever. Oh, it's that the new Diglett. Yeah, the, the, it, or it's uh, it's Wug Trio. Ew. I don't think you can say that. <laughs> yeah, I know it's so weird. She it's, Wug on my trio. Um, <laughs> till it not. All right, I think I'm gonna take the L with this one. Let me think. Um, this has got to be. It looks like it would be like a plant. It, it is it's giving. Plant. I, I think it is a plant. <laughs> it's serving. I, I don't actually know what this is. What? Can you hit? I don't know. Oh, oh. I just haven't Cena. seen this art. That's cute. Jolteon. 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 Let's go. I got one. Uh, okay. So that was fun. And now on the theme of Pokemon, we want to jump into a segment called uh, let's open some Pokemon cards that were sent to me by the Pokemon company, but it's not sponsored. But also thanks for the Pokemon cards, <laughs> the Pokemon company. Please keep sending them. <laughs> yeah, it really rolls off the tongue. <laughs> yeah, I spent a long time workshopping. <laughs> you said you liked names. You, yeah, you name I kind of think I have a gift. I learned yeah. that in early age, so. <laughs> yeah, I didn't, it's okay. I don't want to get back into it. I had, I had some <laughs> feedback and it was not welcome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I shouted at him. <laughs> Um, yeah, my feedback was what sorry I didn't hear you <laughs> so today we're going to be opening some um, we're going to be opening some so? Pokemon 151 let's go Chris just took a photo of me not you I took what a picture fuck? of Dipper what, what in the world thank you get your head out of your ass <laughs> and let me take a photo and let me take a picture yeah. of you you're moving <laughs> we've got a couple of things to open we've got an elite trainer box oh Scarlet and Violet 151 Dipper <laughs> Uh, it's gonna eat nice. the got the Zapdos EX collector's box. Ooh, bam, 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 damn. The, or again, this is not sponsored. I am just a nerd. So, uh, one of my favorite things about the promos from this set is that they have the like a similar hollow pattern to the retro cards. Oh, yeah, you see that like yeah. on the borders and stuff. Cool, it's like the Cosmos foil from like base set two. Wow, which I think is a little callback. Mm-hmm. Uh, like, oh, Dipper, you were just chilling out, dude. He's being a little freak. <laughs> you were just having a, a, the yeah, <laughs> you like hit a spot and then he just started kicking my back. <laughs> ow, ow. I've also got some, um, <laughs> just doing that for fun. What a crazy dog. He truly, I mean, yeah, he could just swallow your dog. Yeah. <laughs> That's a crazy one. I've also, again, not sponsored, but would love to. Uh, got some Dragon Shield clears here just uh, so that you can put these po- put these bad boys in a binder or something. Shout out Dragon Shield. Nice. Curtis, are you still pretty active in the, in the damn scene? The damn card scene? A little bit. Ah, jeez. Slowed down a little bit. It happens. You gotta, yeah. I, I also slowed down. Because... 
Yeah, Good sometimes dish. you spend a lot of money and you're like, why did, why did I do that? Why did I do that? Yeah, and then yeah, you're like, let up. me just recharge. Yeah. <laughs> let me just take a little bit to forget what this feels like. <laughs> yeah. You've like, uh, oh, you've like burned your dopamine receptors on like <laughs> <Yeah, seriously. laughs> opening guards. <laughs> um, but the uh, I, I like opening the new stuff because it's like, uh, not as expensive as the old stuff and it's still super fun and also we didn't pay for this uh, not sponsored but also thank you but thank you <laughs> maybe we start with the poster collection since it's got the gen 1 starters mm-hmm. dude the camera on the new iPhone is really good oh my god I just what the it. hell here we go wow Look at these guys. Who the frig are these guys? <laughs> dude, you're Who's supposed these to know Pokemon? these, dude. So these are the guys. Sprigatito. Sprigatito. <laughs> uh, Fue Coco. Fue Coco <laughs> and Quaxley. Yeah. So, so We're Coco's like some fr- ripoffs of those guys, yeah, I some, think. Some yeah, cheap fucking. <laughs> <laughs> and it's got Mew. I know that one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> one down. You can only open it. You know <laughs> You've got to guess the Pokemon, but it says the name right there. <laughs> <laughs> Learn to read. <laughs> Dude, I swear, like, uh, I, I need a Pokemon companion game for every action I take in life. Like, Pokemon <laughs> taxes, Pokemon <Yeah>. sleep. <laughs> Pokemon sex. <laughs> okay, Magikarp, Mankey, Oddish, uh, Meowth, Machoke, Dugong. Hitmonchan. These artworks are awesome. Y'all. Kakuna. This is like a re release of Gen 1. Alakazam EX. Alakazam EX. Let's go. You know, fun fact about this that um, for reasons that we won't be stating at this current moment, uh, this is the this set has the first printing of Kadabra in like 20 years. Um, all right, I can go next. Yeah. Mike Foley. Yes, this is just for yeah. This is the a- a- ASMR. Yeah, this is a boom right. mic. <laughs> now we're gonna we're just gonna open up the Pokemon pack. Kind of sound like a joke there for a second. <laughs> you want to know how I got these sleeves? <laughs> you want to know how I got these cards? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I bought them. <laughs> eBay. I got him at a card shop. Idiot. Zubat. Primate. Meowth. Onyx. Sorry, I just go into the poker app sometimes. Goldeen. The art is so beautiful. Mm-hmm. Weepin' Bell. Gasly, to answer your question, it is not a reprint of the base set or anything, but it is a, um, uh, it's just a modern set that exclusively uses the Gen 1 cards as like a celebration of sorts. Mm. Protective goggles. I like how we're getting me in stereo right now. Uh, <laughs> Arcanine. Tentacruel. Vileplume Hollow. Uh, for the reverse, sorry. Okay, Problem yeah. reverse is what I meant to say. Bill's transfer. Is that the hollow? And, oh. then, and then the hollow is Machamp. So there's two reverses now in Scarlet oh, and Violet. Whoa. They added them. And there's also no non hollow rares. I got rid of those. Interesting. Um, Machamp, and that's it. Pretty goaded card, though. Pretty goaded. I do love Machamp. Mm-hmm. You know, the nice thing about being uh, two in the weeds with all Pokemon stuff is that I, I, my relationship with certain pokemon changes based on like like different things i have in the game like i've been playing pokemon go with machamp so i'm like oh i like machamp yeah Even though like this card i'm not going to use it <laughs> but i still like him but i still like the guy a lot of history we, we go way back all right jordan it's your turn doing, dude <laughs> Dipper, can you just hop off thank you sir put his ass in your face. <laughs> all right jordy we, i've been doing the asmr version uh whatever you please Okay, so today we're going to be eating. No, uh, no. Uh, what are these for? What are they? Yeah, they're for. No, they're playing yeah, t- tasting. There's a game. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I, you don't. Swallow and I them. should. Yeah. No, I don't swallow. I taste them. Not just swallow. You put in your mouth. You spit it out. <laughs> it's like wine tasting. Yeah. Yeah. Is there a professional method to opening the? the oh yeah, there is a non-destructive way. Oh, and non-destructive. There is. Um, right. Yeah. Let me. I can show you a little. A little trick. So if you. Let me just do a little tutorial here. If you want to open up a pack without destroying the pack, this little tab, you want to hold on to this guy and you want to pinch up here. It, like like so. Okay. And then you can, if you really truly don't want to damage the pack, but you know, you I get a little, 
I get a little rowdy sometimes when I'm when I'm opening yeah. cards. Yeah. Get so a little excited. The Dipper gets a little excited too. The meal is ready. It's not a meal. Okay. Yeah. It's a snack. I know. It's, it's not a, a meal. meal. Yeah, it's something that's no, high over. It's not even a. Tea. It's not even a half meal or any sort of meal. And we don't They're, know that yet because we haven't opened it. It's just something to time over until dinner. <laughs> you can maybe tide yourself over with a game. Okay. Maybe play the Pokemon TCG yeah. or something. If I had one, I'd play it. But he's hungry. had one. What? No, what I have is some food. Okay. All right. Pokemon. Well, okay, <laughs> we got a, uh, I got a Pokeball, guys. Okay, hey, nice. down. <laughs> just, uh, just oh. turn around. Yeah, oh, that's, that's a rare. that's a code card, so I, you can get it, a virtual pack. Those okay yep. in uh, Pokemon uh, trading can, card game live. Someone can grab that. Oh, don't yeah. don't. Yeah, I feel yeah, like I just caught. I did I just it. catch him eating the? Okay. Oh. I think he likes it. <laughs> He's no. What are you doing? <laughs> Stop. Okay. Stop. This is mm, entirely not what you're supposed to. Oh, I print it. <laughs> it comes out. Charizard. Yeah. How did he do? Oh my god! Do it again. Yeah. Wait. We found a Charizard printing right. machine. Ooh. Speak of the devil. It's one in the same. Charmander. This Char Charmander art's very cute. Darmander. Hold on. <laughs> Hold your horses. <laughs> Spiro. Spiro. Oh, that is cute as hell. Damn. Yeah. The art is just. It never disappoints. In fact, I wish I could get like prints of some of these mm -hmm. i already have too much pokemon stuff but yeah. i'm like i want a huge painting of that on the wall something maybe in that style that's not exactly a pokemon but then i know is right. there that system where like six in or something is gonna, the one that could be rare the last card so so they they've made it in the scarlet and violet um block that uh you don't there's no card trick the last card or act, i mean it's like the last three cards are gonna okay. be the the ones mm. dipper Leave it. And those taste the best. You can't eat this. <laughs> what is your deal? How did you feel? He's having the same problem as me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't eat this paper. paper. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, dude, I'm working so hard to try and get a good magic cup. Me too. It's all I want in the world. Oh, wait. Okay, wait, hold on. We we should talk because I have a boatload of magic carp that are sitting in my tradables. Same here. So we can oh just do a little talk off mic. One, two. Yeah, let's talk off mic about let's that. <laughs> money. <laughs> He's still trying to eat the cards. Okay. <laughs> That's sick art. Yeah. Whoa, cool. I see something shining when I move the cards around. Yeah. I don't know what's shining back there. What is shining? Radicate. Yuck. Exterminate. Kill it. <laughs> Firo reverse. Firo. There's another. There's another buy another reverse after that. Is it Oh, it's, it's, yeah, it's kind of shining, huh? Yeah, so this a is a reverse bit. hollow. So instead of the the image oh, being hollow, yeah. the rest of the card is hollow. It's like a passport. It's <laughs> <laughs> like things are <laughs> yeah. on it. And you can use and then, it. Oh, my reverse, oh, dude, that art's so good. Look how cute he is. Cubone. Uh -huh. Look how cube he is. What's, what's up with Cubone's lore? Every single one of them is wearing their mother's skull. Yeah. We don't yeah. ask questions. That's cool. <laughs> And then, Chansey ooh, Harlow Chansey. Chansey. Yeah, let's go, Chansey. All right. right. And then, okay. And then a Yo, energy. green energy. <laughs> let's go. Eat it. Can I? Probably tastes like herbs or something. Um, <laughs> basil. All right. Let's let's now now that we've done this, let's speed this up. So I've got a new idea for round two, which bitch. is going to be. Let's just do. We're going to do a thing called pack battles. What the? A pack battle is uh, whoever gets the best card wins. Battle. Pack battle, smack glattle, chap grattle. Pop. Packling battle. Packle battle. Raffining ladle. <laughs> Eat the card. <laughs> okay. Give me the taste. Pop Pop is a monster. Or I'll freak out. <laughs> <laughs> Brock is a monster. Um, okay, so what we're going to do now. So, Curtis, you win round one because you actually got a. Uh, I got an EX. I fucking killed y'all. You, <laughs> Dude, hold on. Stop running right, it. I win. <laughs> if I knew Fuck. we were competing, I would have done better. <laughs> I would have pulled a better card. He vomits a better card. <laughs> yeah. I didn't know this was a competition. <laughs> <laughs> Comes out like a Polaroid. Um, so, what I'm going to do, uh, what we're going to do now, the stakes or whoever wins the pack battle gets to keep the cards whoa whoa but whoever loses has to do the podcast whoa <laughs> no, you can't leave the pod what um, if we swapped podcasts it'd be fun yeah podcast swap like permanent yeah wait you do yeah. that podcast with bobby Altoff, right really good podcast yeah yeah yeah, yeah. But every you always delete and it she, and you like ripped her off <sighs> i mean i'm <laughs> 
know. I don't want to go on record and say that, but <laughs> he's shaking. She did. She did steal my fucking pipe. <laughs> she took your whole she flow. She did dude. steal my flow. She took your whole flow. Dude. I'm Steve's. supposed to be the monotone woman. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this guy has, uh, I believe, ten packs. So Let's do I. Count one, two, three. <laughs> what do you mean? Four, I have five, a ten six. pack. Huh? What does that mean? In what we a 10 pack. Okay, ten. come oh, down. You know, like how most normal men have six pack? Oh, we all do. Oh, of course. Course. I have a 10 pack. All okay. right, so what I'm going to do. You seem so mad about it. Yeah, because you guys didn't fucking believe me. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't believe you. I mean, I don't. <laughs> Nothing's changed. I'm shuffling up these packs. There's 11 of them. Um, I have them. I have a letter. <laughs> I have a letter. <laughs> letter yeah, I have a legitimately back. disgusting right. idea. <laughs> so, one extra one on so top. Your heart. So we should each. <laughs> we, let's each pick three. There's eleven here. All right. And we pick three, so no one can say that. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. The odds were not in their favor. Fair for them. Mm. So, all right. Let's let's just speed open these. Okay. All Sorry. Right. I'm not gonna tell you what I get though. We're gonna do a blind reveal. Okay. So I'm gonna see what I got, and if I got anything good, I'll present it at the end. So this is like three separate pack battles, right? This, or is so it this one is round, all... round one okay. and round two. This will be our last round. I don't have any fingernails. <laughs> Shit. I'm so glad nobody's seeing this. If this was recorded, I would be so ashamed. You guys are friggin' screwed. Yeah, you guys are so done, dude. You're what are the, uh, so done. You've never been, you've never been more done than you are right now. By the time you see my cards, you're gonna, you're gonna be eating those cards. <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh, what's, dude, what's it? The Someone's dust up. of my cards, dude. My cards are gonna be made of. That's Wait, that's a fun idea. Whoever loses good. has to eat the worst cards. <laughs> no. They don't get all the nice ones the rest of us will eat. Yeah. Okay. So this is my... I've picked out my special card. My special we, card that we're you We're selecting one from the yep, three. You pick one from the three. Oh, uh, okay. And you present... It'll be like a little contest. You like have to present your card. Yeah, why it's the best. Insane. I don't have anything to like, bite my nails like a nasty little bastard. Oh my god. God, <laughs> I pulled God. I you God. pulled the God card. Kind of, yeah. Okay, here we go. Ready? Are we ready? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Set. Reveal. Okay. Oh wow. Curtis is clearly the winner, but <laughs> rats. But great choice of. I mean, we can all give a presentation for our, our Pokemon. Yeah. Can I ask of the uh, of the the forum? <laughs> Would this have been a better choice? It would have, yes. Right. But it still isn't as uh, as rare as this guy mm -hmm. in terms of the rarity tiers of the cards. But this is Mewtwo. That is Mewtwo. That's Mewtwo. Undo yeah. And this is uh, I didn't pull anything, but th <laughs> these these hollow um, energies in the set are so pretty. It's got a swirl. Yeah, it's multiple swirls. There's a swirl right there. Oh right yeah, there. whoa. Swirl right there. Damn, swirl the city, one. dude. And it is like the old school hollow pattern, so it makes me happy. Cool. That's uh, why you picked that one. Yeah, I want a deck full of hollow energies. God damn, this guy's so sick. Uh, I picked mine because it was a really cool full art card, War Turtle. He's, um, I think he's probably the coolest evolution out of the yeah. the, the three. There's a cool like little set of. Uh, I agree, actually. Oh, you know, he's pretty badass. Think of the they, teenager era, the middle. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. You know, I would say that Gen One has the best teenager era middle mm -hmm. evolution because all of it, like War Turtle, sick. Yeah, uh, Ivysaur, edgy. Dope. Yeah. I don't know why. I Not can't ugly explain. yet. Because uh, like, right, yeah, yeah. Ven 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 Venusaur, Venusaur, Venusaur nasty, yeah. gross. <laughs> and Charmeleon is cool too. Charmeleon is cool. Yeah, they're all He's like, like old, my older brother or something. Yeah, like that. they're all like <laughs> a little grumpy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Charmeleon's yeah. the cousin that lets you smoke weed. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Thanksgiving or something. So uh, yeah, that's why I picked that one. The artwork is really pretty. Yeah, and um, it's a really pretty looking card. Yeah, man. You know, there's God packs in the set where they like you open it and it's awful arts. That's crazy. I know. That'd be so cool. Maybe fun. one of them is in there. Can you imagine? All right. Well, uh, I'm going to congrats, Curtis. You're the winner of this. Hey, pack thank battle. you. Mr. Cool. Thank unless you. Unless these two packs contain True, something, something better. even better. And then this goes to like Jacob. Yeah, it goes there to Jacob. Go. Yeah. <laughs> it goes to Dipper. 
Okay. We got oh, a Gary sure. We got a Tentacool. We got a Rattata. We got a Squirtle. We got a Butterfree, a Lapras, Cycling Road, Pidgey, Sand Slash Reverse, Jol- Dolceon. That's a Jolceon Hollow. There's a. Okay. I missed the reverse in there. Okay, cool. So that's not better. All right. Charmander, Spiro, Bellstrap, Magikarp, Golbat, Leftovers, Persian, Nidorina, Giovanni's Ooh. Charisma. A Giovanni's Riz. A Riz based card. Giovanni's car? Riz. Yo, Double it's dude. a full art trainer card. Dude, it's giving daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Guy. Actually, it's Zad, Zad Giovanni. <laughs> Damn. Um, All right. No, that actually is a uh, good pull. And then this cute little dead. Did you also get a hollow energy? Yeah. Oh my god, dude. This is a level of intimacy a with a Pokemon. That that pack may, may have been the most based pack. It feels like an inappropriate level of intimacy with, <laughs> with your pet. What is essentially an employee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the cat's an employee. <laughs> yeah, Pokemon's are kind of employees. Yeah, Pokemon like pets. do their bidding. <laughs> that, I guess that's true. Well, not Persian though. Persian's like a lap cat. True. Yeah. Um, I don't know because... Curtis, you can have the cards. <laughs> no, I win. No, I win. Curtis wins. Yeah, all right. Hey, everybody, big applause for Curtis. Big applause. Oh, he's just a good Mr. Good. Before we go, I had a question I wanted to ask you uh-huh. publicly before we head on over to the Patreon, patreon.com slash uh-huh. boys. Um, do you like touring or <laughs> do the shows? Do you like me? Do you think I'm like cute <laughs> or handsome? Yeah. You choose. No, like okay. the, the actual you process. Decide, like the end of uh, Rap Battles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Who is? <laughs> Who's next? <laughs> All right. Sorry, sorry. Uh, like the actual process, because it's doing the shows, yeah. which is obviously like the incentive. Yeah. No, but is there some kind of catharsis to like, I'm hopping on the plane, I'm going miles away to do my show. I'm going miles Right. Away. Yeah. I think in theory, like in on a pure like like cerebral you know way is like it's like yeah vibes know? based yeah yes. it's like it's gonna be awesome it's hitting the open road you know doing shows and then you you're on the road for like more than a day and you're like uh <laughs> I want to go home. Oh, yeah, I want to fucking... My uh, stuff isn't here. Yeah, I hate... Or it burns down. <laughs> and I... The crazy... The, the toughest part is not shitting on the on the bus. You're not allowed to poop on buses, so... What? Any tour bus, you can't poop I on them. What? Yeah, you can't poop on them. Do you have to go to a loca... Like, you have to get to the hotel before? No Or, way. like, the... you Usually what would happen is you get to a venue at, like, 8 a.m., wake up at, like nine or ten and you can't get into the venue until like noon or one so that's usually where you, you gotta hold your poop until then or nice. find like a starbucks that was the worst part but <laughs> <laughs> yeah but oh, plus you can't what's next can't poop on the bus can't poop on stage yeah it's they're taking our freaking rights away can't poop in the driver's seat <laughs> yeah you can't poop on the fucking driver's lap <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome <laughs> i had to go <laughs> sorry you're the only spot i have <laughs> i had no that's very weird yeah that feels like what I would I would pay a premium for a tour bus where I can me shit. too yeah I was yeah the way you have to do is they call it a hot bag and it's like a plastic bag that you put in the toilet and you poop into it and then you wrap it up and you put it in the like a dog yeah like a dog <laughs> it's pretty because cr- like the plumbing doesn't handle shit well that makes sense they should yeah. you go out the exhaust pipe hot, <laughs> yeah. hot bag is like previous to you saying that I would have associated it with like amazing takeout. Like right. you get a hot steaming bag <laughs> yeah. of Ruined Kung Pao that, chicken yeah. You know, yeah. of fry, french right. fries. In a, but you turn the takeout into a hot bag. Oh, yeah. God, no. Maybe it's it not, was takeout it at was, one point. Yeah. It's, the yeah. bag is paper. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> yeah. Do they provide you with the special bag? Yeah, I feel like you would need... I, w- I would not be comfortable. <laughs> like a Ziploc was, bag or something? Yeah, I wouldn't be comfortable with a hot bag unless it was like double reinforced <laughs> yeah. mega plastic. Yeah, you it's know like what I mean? Ceramic Tupperware. Yeah. yeah, it's just like saran wrap. Really <laughs> thin. <laughs> <laughs> it's like one of those like, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah. Right? yeah. <laughs> uh. Yeah. It's a <laughs> bodega bag. Yeah, the thinnest bag. Yeah. And then always have holes in it. It's just yeah. exploding as you carry one apple. I got really close to using a one on the tour. But then, oh, you never did it? No, I never had to because they were like just pulling. Because they were like, there isn't a, a gas station for like an hour. And I was like, okay, then I guess I have to use this thing. But then they were like, never mind. They 
They have found one. <laughs> they built one just now. They built one. Just now. They just finished. They just cut the. <laughs> yeah. The, 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 <laughs> the mayor just opened this door. Like, the key to the city to like quick stop yeah. or whatever. And I got to, I got services. to christen the uh, the new, <laughs> that, the new <laughs> truck stop. That's so funny. Yeah. Um, the, the technology should have been developed. You <laughs> think by now? You do yeah. on a plane? Yeah. Yeah. It's like a bus, and that's way higher. And that's up. That's yeah. way further. But if they were like no pooping on the plane, yeah. <laughs> then there's yeah. the guy who grounded the Barcelona. <laughs> yeah, like shitting on the yeah. ground. You'd be like, the no, <laughs> give me the hot bag. <laughs> we're running out of time. I'm that's what well, they, the plane does give you hot bags in the thing in the. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's yeah. True. You know, you, you know misunderstood what those are for. <laughs> what are they for? Oh Jesus! Mm, How many times have you used those? News. Every time. No. Do you go to the bathroom to do it? You don't have. They're right in front. You of don't you. have to. You no, stand no, up. You they do take have the seatbelt sign off. Right. Grab the hot bag. Bing. Stand up. <laughs> turn around. <laughs> drop trowel. <laughs> drop a deuce. If you <laughs> did that, and this is maybe good for you to know for your for your stand up special. It would make national news. <laughs> you yeah, good that on a plane. yeah, that's the press tour. I got so do. I'm just saying, like, you could just claim you were the other guy because his name never became public. Because you know, mm, you, mm-hmm. you you've had a pretty good track record thus far. That if you did that, it truly would be on CNN. Yeah. <laughs> <It> yeah. <would. laughs> All right. Yeah, that's a good. That's a good. Yeah, like, just a, just a little like, pro tip for you. Yeah. yeah, it would be interesting to try and pivot back from <laughs> guerrilla <that>. marketing. <laughs> yeah, throwing, throwing the shit. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I'm the shit guy. <laughs> That's the total rebrand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, do you have a what's the poster? Of like Things the, were going great, and you went for a worse <laughs> rebrand. Yeah. <laughs> do you have like a uh, triggered much? You know, kind of poster. You yeah, it's like me with color. yeah that with like a tie that's undone nice. and uh, lampshade, and, and I'm giving and I'm like. Yeah. Yikes. Can't see anything. There's anymore. like a there's like a, a scantily clad model like pulling your tie. Yeah. With like, like a with like a bur- <laughs> with like a burger in her hand. Like yeah. that one Carl's Jr. Ad. Yeah. Yeah, my it's like a GoDaddy commercial. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, it's an integration. Yeah. Danica Patrick drives her, yeah. her yeah. NASCAR through the set. By this time this is out the special is out? No, I don't no, think so. November. No, November. Yeah, no, November, November. But we're just getting feelers out. We're just getting, we're just letting the people know, man. November 10th. <laughs> get out know. there. And vote. And vote. <laughs> with your attention. Yeah. I like my, this guy. I like yeah. this. Stay yeah, who's that guy? Out there. Get him on my website. This is like your Bill Ingvall, Jeff <laughs> Foxworth, your blue <laughs> yeah. collar comedy tour. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm doing that right now. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Just fucking watch it. I don't know. It'll be on my site website. You'll have to buy a ticket for the live premiere, and then you can watch it on demand for a little bit after. But it's gonna be really great, and I worked really hard on it. And I hope you watch it and you like it. But that's hey, it. Hey, we've seen Curtis Curtis stand up, and yeah, it's okay. I was mostly I was mostly busy going postal on a hot bag at the time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Downright devious. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I kind of, yeah, I, I was hitting a triple bag score where mm-hmm. I was just filling up bag after bag. <laughs> they had yeah. a bunch of them at the merch table. Yeah, yeah. Made the custom hot bags. It was like, made, it said, yeah, it said Curtis Town. Yeah. It was like a shirt. Big also. hole in one part and <laughs> two smaller holes. Which I think yeah, is a I think idea. it all doubled as a shirt, but I yeah. was like, I know what a hot bag is when I see it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I know a hot bag. There's one guy. I get the extra large hot bag. <laughs> Like, what? Trust me. Yeah, trust me. It's been a day. They're, they're like, uh, are you sure? It's like, you're going to wish you had a double X. Yeah. <laughs> that is an incredible fact. <laughs> yeah, I think you're lying um, when you say you haven't done it. Thanks for no, no, uh, no. Dude, Curtis, thank you so much for joining us. We will be jumping over to patreon.com slash sadboys for a little after show we like to call Sadboys Nights. Dipper will be asleep on the couch like this. Aww. We will continue eating Kit Kats. I might order dinner. And we're going to uh, talk about some st- other stuff. Um, <laughs> it's pretty... <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much, Curtis, for joining us. Thanks always for a pleasure. Me. Thank You're you. You're always welcome. Howdy. Please leave. Um, All right. <laughs> but go to his I website. To, I do have to use a hot bag. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> go to his website, curtisconnor.com. November 10th, the show. What's it called again? Keep Busy. Yeah. My first special. Please watch it. Oh, that's a great title. Keep Busy, My First Special. Please watch it. Yeah, please watch it. <laughs> <laughs> that's the full phonetic. Rare. <laughs> Thank you. Um, Thanks, everybody. All right, cool. See you on See the you. bonus. 
Oh, and we end every episode of Sad Boys with... It's been a while since I've done this, okay? Uh, mm. We end every episode of Sad Boys with a particular phrase. We love, love, you. love you and we're sorry. My oh, bad. We did it. Did we survive like an era of like man marketing? You remember the bacon on everything era? At this, I was at some fucking like souvenir shop somewhere and there was like bacon chapstick oh, from, like bacon like band-aids. That's yeah. actually kind of fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they the, I'm saying these are, these are all the good cut. things I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, like bacon candles. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Gucci girl, Gucci girl, how you doing? How you moving girl? Moving girl, how's your day looking at future girl? Future girl, yeah, we on now Take my money, go away, oh, you want it Get too rich for me